Cooking a correct meal in a correct Ghana light soup is always fun and the best. In this video, I share with you my five best Ghanaian light soup recipes. Welcome to this channel where I share with you how to make simple Ghanaian traditional and intercontinental recipes. At number five is this turkey mackerel light soup. So in a pan, I'm adding in some smoked turkey and then I'll go ahead and blend those ingredients. That's some onion, ginger, garlic, three spice mix and some cube of maggi with some water and then add it to the turkey. I'll then add in some salt, cover for at least five minutes and then take everything that is the smoked turkey out from the pan and add water to it. So I'll add in the fresh mackerel and any type of fresh fish can be used. I'll then cover it and leave it to steam for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, I'll add back the smoked turkey. Followed by carrot juice and this carrot juice has um, cooked carrot and pepper blended with water and then strained. Now I'll add in tomato and onion cover it to start boiling for at least 10 minutes and then add in some tomato paste after adding the tomato paste i'll take out all the fresh mackerel and set it aside this is just to ensure that the mackerel doesn't you know get too soft or um, i'll then take out the tomato and the onion and blend it and pour it back into it so after adding in the blended tomato i'll add back the mackerel and then add in some paprika which is optional let it cook for 10 minutes and then serve yourself now at number four is this delicious chicken light soup now i'm gonna blend all these ingredients that is some ginger garlic paprika and some basils with some water and then add it to the clean washed chicken followed by some all-purpose seasoning some salt i'll give it a very good stir and then leave it on fire to cook for some five to ten minutes now in another pan i'm cooking some garden eggs turkey berries and pepper and i'll leave it to cook completely checking on the chicken i'll give it a stir and once again cover it to cook for let's say five to ten minutes now after the ten minutes or five minutes it depends on the temperature of your fire i add in some chopped onions and leave it to cook i'll then add in some tomatoes some onions cover it and then add in the blended garden eggs you know juice now i added in some carrots and cover it to start boiling after about five to ten minutes i give it a stir and then add in some smoked tilapia this is directly from ghana it has really you know a nice taste i'll then remove the tomatoes and the onions together with the carrots and blend them very nicely I pour the blended mixture back into the soup, give it a very good stir and then cover for it to cook completely. Now you would want to taste for some salt and adjust the salt to your taste and preference. I rinse the blender to add the water to it. Simple. Now the soup was so much. It was really delicious. In fact, superb. Now serve with some fufu, some rice, like anything at all so let's move to number three at number three is this pork light soup oh heavens mm. get yourself those ingredients there's some tomatoes some onions paprika in fact i'm going to list everything down in the description so to start with cut wash your pork and then add in some vegetable seasoning add in some diced onions and then add in water cover and let this steam for like five minutes 
after five minutes add in some vegetables which are some carrots onions and some pepper some ginger garlic some metals and some onions cover and let the steam for additional five minutes now not to overcook the vegetables after five minutes take out all the vegetables you added and blend it with some water now strain it into your pork and see how beautiful this is i'm adding in some pepper which is totally optional and then two tablespoons of tomato paste or tin tomato now cover and let it boil for 12 to 15 minutes enjoy yourself now at number two is this cabbage chicken light soup in fact this soup was really really nice now cut wash clean your chicken and add in some all purpose seasoning some salt diced or chopped onions some water and cover to steam now in another pan add some ginger garlic onion pepper some cabbage and then add in some carrots like carrots is totally optional add water to it and cover to cook completely checking on the meat after five minutes give it a very good stir and once again cover to steam for five minutes now the vegetables are well cooked set it aside for it to cool down completely adding some tomato puree to the chicken and cover for five minutes blend your cabbage and the other vegetables with some water and strain it into your soup or your chicken see how beautiful this is adjust the salt to your preference cover and let this cook for 15 to 20 minutes delicious and enjoy at number one which is my favorite is this dry fish soup in fact this soup is loaded packed and it is the typical Ghanaian traditional light soup it is so delicious and amazing and oh my goodness now let's start with the preparation in the pan i'm adding in some cow tail and then add water and cover to cook now in another pan i'm adding in some, some garden eggs turkey berries some pepper and then add in water and let it cook completely now on the other side chop some onions and then i'll add it to the cow tail which is now boiling I'll go ahead and add in a stock of cube and cover once again for at least five minutes. So back to the garden eggs, it is cooked now. I'll just strain the water out from it and then add to the pot or to the cooking pot the dry cleaned fish. Now look at those fishes. I have some um mackerel fish that is smoked in fact it is loaded now the garden eggs is well cooled down or somehow cooled down i put it in a blender add in some water and then blend it nicely <laughs> oh heavens i strain the garden eggs into the soap or to the fishes you know So I'm going to add in some onion and then some tomatoes. I'll cover it and leave it to cook for let's say five minutes. Now the aroma of it, <laughs> you can even eat it with some fufu, just the aroma. I take out the tomatoes and the onion and blend it with some water. Now I arrange the blender and add the water to it. Hmm. This soup, this soup, this soup okay cover and let it boil or cook for some time and then you serve your soap this soap is my favorite and it is number one thank you so much for watching this video i hope you did enjoy it and also watch my other videos which you are going to enjoy i'm going to list everything down in the description once again thank you very much and always remember to do everything in love Juice.